Number 39. Calculate the molality of each of the following solutions. And then we have letter C. So in this case, we have 25 grams of Cl2 in 125 grams of dichloromethane, which is a CH2Cl2. And we have to find the molality. Now, there's only one general formula to solve for a molality, and that is this one right here. Molality, not molarity, molality equals moles of your solute divided by your kilograms of your solvent. But now the thing is, they didn't tell me explicitly which, uh, you know, substance is the solute and which substance is the solvent. Now, just know that your small little solute generally is a solid, but it doesn't have to be. But the small little solute gets dunked in the solvent. So the solute goes in the solvent. And if we just look at the wording, they said that we had 25 grams of the Cl2 in this dichloromethane. So because of that, the Cl2 is the solute and the CH2Cl2 is the solvent. So now we would know what unit we have to convert to. The 25 grams of the Cl2, since that's the solute, I want it in moles. So let's start with that one. 25 grams of Cl2. I don't want grams anymore because the formula calls for moles. So let's convert to moles of Cl2 grams to moles, going all the way back to the beginning of chem, if you want to convert from grams to moles, all you have to do is just divide by the molar mass, right? So let's just find out the molar mass of Cl2. We have two chlorines, and each one weighs 35.45. So two times 35.45, we get 70.9. So I'm going to take that 25 grams and divide it by 70.9. So let's see how many moles we got. So we get roughly 0 0.3526. That's good enough. Okay, moles done. Now we need to take the solvent, which is the CH2Cl2, and go to kilograms. Well, they gave us grams, 125 grams of the CH2Cl2. But that's okay, because I just want to go to kilograms. Um, how do we go from grams to kilograms? Once again, all the way in the back of, well, the beginning of the class, we would just divide by 1,000. Or you can take your decimal and move it to the left, three slots. So this would be 0 0.125 kilograms. I got the moles. I got the kilograms. Let's plug it in. Molarity, not molarity, it's just habit. <laughs> Molality equals, and just know that molality is always that italics lowercase m. Uh, so the, let's see, the moles of the Cl2 is 0 0.3526 divided by the 0 0.125. So I'm just going to take this full answer and divide it by 0.125. And there you go. We get two point, I guess technically we need two sig figs because of the two in the 25. So 2.8. And the units for molality, you can just put that, that, italics little m. And that's it. Done with that one. What do you think? Oh yeah. I hope this helped. Thank you for coming here to get help with your chem course. We also have physics and math videos on the channel, so go check it out. My brother and I, we really do appreciate all you guys. Thank you so much for your support, and we're so glad that we can help you guys in your classes. Let's keep studying hard, always keep learning, and good luck on those tests and quizzes, okay? I'm rooting for you. I'll talk to you soon. Okay, bye.